Franken decried what he described as the repeated lies of the Trump administration, including the president's baseless claim that millions of people voted illegally in the 2016 election. It's all based on a lie and not a lie President Trump came up with, Franken said. Right-wing conservatives have been raising a false alarm about so-called voter fraud for years despite the fact that no credible evidence has ever been demonstrating that it is a real problem. The same, Franken said, goes for the administration's policies affecting the LGBT community. Franken also lamented Trump's attacks on science, citing a recent Washington Post report that said the Trump administration had prohibited the Centers for Disease Control from using such terms as evidence-based and science-based. We now have enough evidence to conclude that climate change is real and it is man-made and it is a threat to our nation's security and an existential threat to the planet, Franken said. President Trump didn't launch the war on science but now he's leading the charge. Franken, who is stepping down on January 2, praised his replacement, Minnesota Lt. Gov. Tina Smith, as a worthy successor. I have no doubt Sen. Smith will serve Minnesotans and all Americans well, Franken said. Franken did not mention the allegations of sexual misconduct that led to his resignation. In a speech on the Senate floor announcing his intention to step down earlier this month, Franken insisted that some of the claims were not true and others he remembered differently. He concluded Thursday's speech on a positive note. Politics is about the improvement of people's lives, Franken said. The American people know that to be true. And they fill me with hope for out future.